Mark Lane, MCC head coach. Thanks for joining us. Um, we're here at Lords today, uh, just before the test. How are the MCC and the young cricketers helping both England and the West Indies prepare? Well, this is a, a major date for the young cricketers uh, in their calendar. Um, this week and all test match weeks, um, for a number of reasons. And the young cricketers get a chance in the net to, to bowl at the best batsman in the world at the moment. So they can benchmark themselves, see where they're at. But equally, they can watch the best bowlers um, bowl against the best batsmen and they can observe from real close quarters. Most importantly, they can see how they're preparing to play in the Lord's Test themselves. Um, they even get an option to, um, to pick the brains of, uh, of the batters, just ask maybe what they were thinking when they were facing them. So they're getting quality feedback live in a net session. You can't get better than that. Ian both and Mark Warren, West Indies captain Darren Sammy are just some of the uh, graduates from the MCC Young Academy. And what's the secret behind the success so far? Well, I, I think the main secret is that the MCC kind of lives and breathes cricket. So a anyone that comes here knows that it is all about the game, developing the game and giving back to the game. So that having the opportunity to have the facilities here and the coaching resources it is a big big coup for the youngsters. And finally then, uh, you've got West Indies heritage yourself from yep. growing up in Barbados. Um, how do you think the West Indies are shaping up for this test match? Uh, so if you look at the last series, the West Indies in the West Indies against Australia, I think even though they, they lost the series, you know, they would walk out of that series feeling pretty good about themselves. They'll give the Aussies a hard time. However, this is going to be um, kind of different gravy, if you like. Um, you saw the spinners dominating that series. Uh, I would imagine with the, with the English uh, late spring summer as it is, the seamers are going to get a little bit more joy and the batsmen haven't had chance to play in England um, so far on the tour. So that's going to be the biggest challenge.